Hello and welcome back to a brand new video. EA just dropped the Saudi team of the season and when I saw this I knew there was one guy I wanted to test out. Alioski. Remember that video I did with Trykovski? I used him there and his silver cut was pretty damn good. So I'm going to use it. 3 star, 2 star, not ideal. Uh, I'm not going to play him left back because that's uh, very boring. I'm going to play him Cam instead of Netfat who will sub off. Uh, I've got Pandev up as striker because like last time I didn't use him. It's weird when you're using uh, North Macedonian players, but you don't use Pandev. So uh, I fixed this, uh, this video. Uh, and as you can see on my bench, I don't have a left back. So Guri will be changed with the team of the season Raum. Just that you're not confused when, uh, when I sub on Raum. But this is my team. Let's play some foot champs. My first opponent has this team. That's not a great team. He uses a couple of the same players that I do. But uh, it looks to be a very good team. Trykovsky showing a bit of the magic that he showed in the Unsung Hero episode. Pandev makes it 1-0. And I didn't even put uh, Alioski as a cam. So uh, pretty damn good. And as you can see, I was playing some good football. Because I don't have a lot of pace up front. So I need to play it out. And then Alioski, great shot on his left foot. 2-0 up. You think, well, you're going to win this game. It's going to be an easy game. Uh, and then started... Some of the worst defending I've ever done. This is bad, but a very good goal. This is even worse. Raspadori can just run into a straight line. No one stops him and he makes it 2-2. So that's bad. And uh, things get worse just uh, when the second half starts. I get unlucky a couple of times, but that's just FIFA. And he makes it a 3-2 with Kiesa. I was creating a ton of chances. Like it was an all-out siege on his goal. But I wasn't uh, scoring until Trykovsky did this. And like I said, we were completely dominating this game. So I was very confident that I was going to win. But he had Sirigu. And if you know one thing, that it's, uh, then it's that Sirigu is a very, very good goalkeeper. As you can see here, basically everything that I tried, Sirigu was just there saying, No, no, you're not going to score. And uh, if Sirigu didn't save it, then uh, the ball got blocked by one of his players. So, a very difficult game. As you can see, Alioski, this is an easy goal for Pandev and still Sirigu is there. I don't know what this man took before the game, but please get him to the uh, doping control. Elmas can't finish because Sirigu is just a rock. Then in overtime, Elmas finally beats Sirigu and we're 4-3 up. What a game. And then just before the first overtime ends, Alioski finds Pandev. 3-5. Game is done and dusted. We managed to grab a win, even though it cost a lot of sweat. This guy was uh, not that good, but Sirigu was saving everything. If you look at the stats, it's pretty damn crazy. Uh, Alioski got a goal and an assist, but uh, all the North Macedonian boys were pretty damn good. Now let's go straight into the second game. Second opponent has a bit of a better team, but still nothing I can't beat. Pandev gets the first opportunity and he's a cold killer in front of goal. So we're 1-0 up after just 10 minutes. Pretty damn good. He makes a mistake with his goalkeeper. Mon is there. Keeps calm, gives the ball to Pandev and that's 2-0. And my opponent thinks I'm not going to let Pandev score a hat-trick against me. So before that can happen, I'm gone. It takes a while before he quits, but then he actually quits. So... Alioski didn't really have time to do anything. Pandev did get two goals, so that's uh, pretty damn good. I went into the third game and then this happened. I have no idea what's happening, so uh, this game won't count. Let's play the real third game. Final opponent has this team. Full Premier League, very, very good. Doesn't waste any time scoring a goal. Pretty weird goal. A lot of time to play, so we can come back. We're second half already. Alioski with some good dribbling. Elmas finds Willock, who is subbed on as a winger. Gets fouled by Ruben Diaz, so that's a penalty. Diaz gets a yellow card. I'm going to take the penalty with Alioski. I wasn't sure, because he's obviously not the best penalty taker. But it's his video, so I'm going to take the penalty with him. He makes it, so 1-1. One, one. Great pass from him. And then, I don't understand, I was pressing, like... That Rome should head the ball away. He doesn't do it. Still, he plays it out very, very well. Nothing to complain for. Just very weird that Rome would do that. Pandev finds Tonali, who opens up to Trykovsky. 
As you can see, I'm just playing calm football. Even with Willock, I have a bit more pace, but not enough. That's a good tackle. We keep the ball. Alioski can't finish, but Trykovsky is there to put the ball into the net. So 2-2. We're going to the final minutes of the game. Pandev puts Willock through on goal. That's going to be the winner, but Alisson saves it with an amazing save. Raheem Sterling finds Diaz. We find Silva, gets blocked, Silva gets the ball back, dribbles a bit, finds Harry Kane who makes it 3-2. Rome finds Alioski, gives the ball to Tonali, one of my favorite cards, makes it 3-3. So we're still in this game and I feel like we can win it. Elmas finds Willock and my opponent is defending the pass and not a shot, so I'm going to take a shot and I make it 3-4. This is all the game had to offer, pretty tense in the last minutes, but we managed to keep the win, which is uh, pretty damn good. So three games, three wins with the North Macedonian boys, that's a very, very good. Alioski got a goal and an assist, which is uh, not too bad for someone who plays left back in the Saudi league when you're playing a scam. So as you can see, I will reach my uh, desired rank and I will open the rewards, but first we'll take a look at uh, the stats of the player that I used in Alioski. So technically three games and two goals and two assists. That's uh, pretty damn good. But the whole team was uh, very fun and very good to play with. But let's jump straight into the rewards. So I get two picks from the Bundesliga team of the season. There are a lot of good players in the Bundesliga team of the season that I really want like Wurz and of course Nkunku. And in the first pick I get to pick Nkunku which is amazing. He was extinct for a bit. So very nice I get his red card. Then this, I already have team of the season Neuer, so I uh, go with Muller. It's only one rating, so it doesn't really matter. But these are two very good red picks, uh, in my opinion. Now let's open the two packs that I got. One is a rare player pack, and the other I think is an ultimate pack, but I'm not sure. I'm never really that lucky with uh, my, uh, my packs. In rewards in my rare player pack I don't really get it. I get Griezmann which is not too bad to use in SBCs that uh, will come hopefully when the pro league team of the season uh, arrives we will get some very good team of the seasons ultimate pack which I'll open we get a team of the season is it the Bundesliga one yes and it's Thomas Müller of course because I picked him with my red picks but that's going to be all for this video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.